forging cyber, forging cyber security experts. Secure Ninja. All right, what's up ninjas? Welcome back for our second edition of Whiteboard Friday. What we're gonna talk about today is Linux. Now, back when Jesus was walking the earth many, many moons ago when I first started hacking, you absolutely had to learn Linux. There was no way around it because that's where all the hacking was done. Now, fast forward to 2014 where we're at now, it's not like that anymore. Most of the security tools that we use today run on Windows. So you don't need to be the Linux ninja like you did years ago when I first started. Now, where, where you do have to think about it is today, almost everything runs Linux. There's so much Linux. Linux is freaking everywhere today. You know, most of the web servers on the web are Linux. Most of the embedded devices are Linux. Mobile devices, right? And then, even more important for those of you who are into this, Penetration testing distributions, Kali, Backtrack, uh, Samurai, OWASP Live, all these things are Linux-based attack distributions that you're going to be using for your pen testing. Same thing with like forensics distributions. You know, you've got like forensics distributions, you know, live images that you can use for forensics. You know, this is just where it's at. So if this is what you're going to have to deal with, then I'm going to have to tell you a really, I hate to say it, painful, blunt truth. Look, man, you need to throw away the parachute. You want to learn how to fly this plane? You got to throw the parachute out the window. You want to get rich. You got to either make more money or you got to want less stuff. You want to lose weight. You got to either exercise more or you got to eat less. You want to learn to use Linux? Then, hey, man, you got to use Linux. That's it. I wish I could put it to you, you know, in a nice elegant way, but look man, if you want to get this, you just have to do it. So, it's not rocket science. If you want to learn Linux and you're a little, how should I say this, command line challenged, a little bit afraid, it's okay, right? Go to linuxsurvival.com. LinuxSurvival.com is a website with a web tutorial and a little web interface that you type the commands into. And it walks you along, it tells you this story, teaches you the Linux file system, teaches you the basic Linux commands, and that's where you can get familiar with Linux. After that, you might want to go to FreeVideoLectures.com. Now the full link is slash blog slash 2012 slash 04 slash 5 dash websites dash learning dash Linux. Don't worry, when we paste this video on YouTube, I'll actually paste in the full link so you can get there. Don't worry, we'll get you there. But these two websites are going to be what gets you over the hump. When you're trying to learn Linux, you just got to get over the hump. Get to the point where you're comfortable enough to drive it. Once you can drive around and move around in Linux, then what you really need to do is build stuff. That's where you're going to use HowToForge.com. HowToForge.com is flat out the best resource I've ever seen on the internet for this. You want to go and you want to learn how to build web servers, mail servers, DNS servers, uh, load balancers, reverse proxies, anti-spam gateways, right? Intrusion detection systems, malware analysis platforms, right? Anything on any distribution you want to build, Linux, uh, excuse me, HowToForge.com is going to have a tutorial for it. And I'm talking step-by-step -step tutorials where you can copy paste the commands, screenshots of everything, and then at the end of it, the virtual machine that they use to to make the tutorial, you'll be able to download it as well. I haven't seen a better resource out there than How To Forge. Now, guys, you know I don't know any of the guys over at How To Forge, uh, but I've been a member of How To Forge for God seven, eight years now, something like that. It's a flat-out amazing website. So this is really where you want to get. You got to get to this skill level of building stuff. When you can build stuff with Linux and you can really kind of know how this stuff all works together and how these different components talk, that's where you're really trying to get. This is where you need to get to be a competent IT security professional. Now, 
if you want to take it and kick it up a notch, you want to take it to the next level, then you need to step into Linux from scratch. Linux from scratch is a website that's going to teach you how to build your own version of Linux so that it can run on anything, on, on your phone, on a watch. Uh, maybe you want to write your own Linux distribution to run on your router at home. You know, maybe you fly uh, unmanned aerial vehicles and you want to write your own Linux distribution to control it, right? All that stuff is here. You want to build your own router, your own firewall. All that stuff is on linuxfromscratch.org. This is where you want to go to learn how to do that. Did I mess up and say .com? It's linuxfromscratch.org. All right, guys. Well, that's it for this edition of Whiteboard Friday. Going to see you next week for our next one. You take care. Secure Ninja TV is brought to you by SecureNinja.com, a world leader in cybersecurity training and certification. Our master instructors will help build you into a highly skilled and marketable security professional. Secure Ninja, forging cybersecurity experts.